I just want to make sure everybody can hear us and everything before we get started. No echo. Uh, can y'all just respond to us real quick and tell us if you can hear the echo and IG? Okay, somebody said much better. All right, so we should be good to go then. So like I was saying, today we are, um, we're just rocking out because it's the 4th of July. And I know a lot of y'all are, you know, probably getting back from your barbecues or maybe you're just getting ready to go. I don't know what y'all are doing. I didn't even know that today was the 4th of July. But the timing of this program is amazing because what we're going to be doing is um, taking you all through a, a fasting experience. Let's see here. Hey, Steve, uh, switch your, um, switch your uh, Wi-Fi to uh, telephone. I think we're having too much stress on the um, bandwidth. Okay. Let me see. E you good, Steve? Yeah, it's just your 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 face is frozen on me. But, um, I mean, I'm good. Okay, looks like yeah, as long as long as you can hear me and everything, that's all that matters. Yeah, it looks like YouTube's good. Oh wait, when Stephen talks only. <laughs> this man, he said, "Yo, this man go from fat to skinny like it's nothing." Um, I the the last message I saw, Stephen has an echo. Uh, I have an echo. Yeah. Let's take this out. How about now? Okay, looks like the echo's gone now. Okay, the live is um is actually paused, so that's probably why the echo's gone. <clears throat> well, this might be too much for my system to do both at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to try this one more time because it basically froze. Did you take your phone off of uh, Wi-Fi? Yeah. Okay, let's try this one more time. Appreciate y'all's patience. Yeah, we just trying to get everybody going, yeah, doing something different today. Steve, feel free to go ahead and get going if you want. Oh, um, where? I don't know what's happening. I just I got so much going on right now. I'm not, <laughs> this is crazy. Um, where am I? Where Where are we at? Are we on YouTube? Are we on Instagram? YouTube. Okay. So, as Chris is continuing to work on uh, just getting the Instagram up and running. Um, we got something a little special for you guys. And it is, as you can see, uh, it's the AHA 21 day fasting challenge, right? Renew, reset, restore, triple R, call it what you want it, right? But it is, uh, it's, it's a fast. It's a 21 day fasting challenge that we designed particularly to be uh, starting after uh, the holiday. Uh, because a lot of times people will <laughs> these holidays come up and what happens is is they say well oh listen what i'm going to do is is after the holiday right after after the fourth of july you know after i have the burgers the hot dogs the the mac and cheese right i have all of this good stuff drinks i'm going to start my fast and then unfortunately that's that's the worst time to do it um and especially if you do it with no understanding of what to do like what is uh, what what you what steps you should be taking? It's going to be really detrimental to you, not just on a physical level, um, but also primarily also on on an emotional level as well, which is going to further uh, cause you physical distress uh, from hitting your goals. Uh, so this is what the uh, so the challenge is designed to get us started. Uh, <laughs> I love this chat. Hey Steve. 
Yes. Uh, go ahead and join the live on Instagram again, and let's see if we can get it going without an echo. All right, y'all. So, okay. yeah, so um, here's what we're going to do. To, we're going to give you all a little bit of information about the, the challenge, um, you know, what it all entails, because it's, a, it's actually it's a 21 day fast is the goal here. Now, what I want to tell you all up front is you don't actually have to necessarily do the full 21 days. But what we're doing is we're providing a platform for you all to, to get accountability as well as uh, we've put together a program over the course of the next um, 30 days. So it's a 30 day program or it's a 30 day. All these people want to join on Instagram. It's a 30 day uh, period of time. And the, the goal is to, to do some prepping before you actually start the fasting. Because one of the things that I've noticed is most of us have issues with prepping, you know, before our fast. So we're going to get you guys in, we're going to do some prepping, and then we're going to start the fast. So it's 30 days total, but the actual fast is going to be about 21 days. And you're cool. Like if, if you can't do the full 21, that's fine. If you want to do 14 days or whatever, that'll all be good. Steve, I'm hearing a little feedback from you. Is it is it um, quiet on your end? Yeah, man, I don't hear anything. I have everything turned down. Okay, it um, must just be coming through your uh, earphones. Yeah. Okay, all right. So everybody, IG and YouTube, let us know if we're getting any echo or anything right now, because otherwise we're gonna keep going if we're good. So just give us a thumbs up and let us know. I know uh, YouTube got a little. Okay, someone in IG said I'm on day f uh, four of my 33 day fast. So if you're already fasting and you're interested in, you know, having that accountability, then you can join as well. Um, it doesn't matter, especially if you're already on your fasting journey. Looks like no echo. So we're good to go, Steve. And we don't have any connection issues. So we're rocking out. See, look, you just got to put a little time, effort, energy into it, baby. Get it done. All right. So now that we got everybody together, um, I'm just going to quickly reiterate. The goal here is to get the entire AHA community involved in a 21 day fast. Now, the 21 day fast might sound a little bit extreme for some of you all. Uh, maybe you've only ever done, you know, one or two, three days, maybe of fasting. That's completely fine. Uh, what we've actually done is uh, we've created a Facebook group that's going to be separate from AHA. Steve, why are you looking like that? I'm just looking at both. My, I got I got two cameras. I don't know who to look at, man. So I'm just I'm just making faces. All right. So so the goal here is to uh, get everybody on kind of one page, because what we noticed in the Facebook group, people would try to like start their little their little uh, groups for like fasting and accountability. And what would happen is after three days a week, it would kind of fizzle out. So we've been seeing that a lot. Not only that, but we've been teaching our 40 day wellness class and we've noticed the intense bonding and, you know, just it's such an amazing experience when you put people in a group together. They're all of, of one mind and one accord. Um, and so we saw the power of that and we wanted to extend that to the larger audience. So whether or not you're already doing a fast or, you know, if you just want to start your first extended fast, uh, whatever the case is, this is the this is the challenge that's going to be issued to the entire group. Enjoy the rest of your 4th of the July. I, I keep saying the 4th of the July. <laughs> keep enjoying the rest of the 4th of July because um, we're going to start prepping for our fast come next week or come this week right um yeah you got you got they don't know they don't know the dates yet man okay all right let me get let me put some dates out here let me try and try and get get things organized here we've had a rough start okay, so man. so take, take oh, 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 hold on a second go ahead what you need some take, time no nah, no nah, i don't need no time man. take a breath man people 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 in, in youtube said uh they said whatever program i'm on they want what i got they they want that steven steven yeah, michael I, I told him I got some skinny neck action going on, man. Look at the, look at my neck, man. On YouTube, they can see more than a neck. Yeah, they got yeah, they can see my, my, my. They can see your whole body. Yeah, man. man I'm looking. 
Oh, I'm looking there. good, man. There he goes. Dang, look at this. I get one or two compliments all of a sudden. Sorry, I cannot. All right, All so right, so so who who wants to be on Steve Slim Fast program? That's <laughs> <laughs> that's essentially what it is. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna let y'all enjoy the rest of your Fourth of July. Get that all knocked out. But we are going to start allowing people to sign up for the 21 day fast this week. All right, so you can sign up today. You can sign up tomorrow. You can sign up all week long. On the 12th. OK, on July 12th, we're going to actually start the prep for the fast. So that gives you about a week to to get signed up and everything like that. Today is the first day that we're announcing it. So we want to give you all some time to actually, you know, get a chance to know that we're even doing this thing. Um, get your mind right. And then on the 12th, we're going to start the prep. So don't worry if you're watching this video and it's after the 12th. We're still prepping. Right. So the, the prep starts on the 12th and everybody who joins after the 12th, you will get all of the information about prepping. Um, you're more than welcome to start your prep late uh, if you want to. The most important thing is the information. And then the 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 well. Two things are equally as important, the information and also the accountability you get from being in the group. All right. So, Steve, um, do you want to kind of like outline like what are what are some of the things that people are going to get by being a part of the group? Yeah, um, on YouTube, I, I think that somebody said that the echo was back, but I think that's because I I yelled and I got a little loud. Okay. So uh, okay, so you I'm sorry. So you saying what are they going to be getting when they join? Yeah, what do they get when they join? All right. So when you guys when you guys join, uh, you are going to uh, number one have access to uh, the AHA coaches, right? So you have Chris, myself, uh, and uh, probably a few other AHA coaches that you guys are unaware of. Um, what you're also going to receive is you're also going to get a quick start study guide, and the quick start study guide is going to have uh, a lot of essential information that we're going to be going through uh, throughout the 21 day uh, fasting program. Um, but it is a it's a quick start or a quick reference guide. So if if you have a question about prep and you don't necessarily have the time to go and watch the entire prep video that we're going to uh, provide to you, uh, then you have the quick start that you can just uh, look at really quickly and then get information. Um, we're going to be uh, giving uh, providing two live sessions during the time, probably more to be honest, but you're going to get at least two, uh, which we're going to go live. We're going to go, you know, answer questions during the fasting period. Um, we're going to uh, be disseminating information. So we're going to be teaching, right? So you, you're going to get at least five uh, lessons as well, pre recorded videos. We're going to talk about um, prep, obviously, which is the main thing. Um, and, I'll, and I'll talk about that in a second, but you're also, you're going to get prep, you're going to get um, mindset coaching, right? So how to prepare your mind mentally, what you should be thinking about when you're going through your fasting period, what to think about when days get tough, right? Um, we're going to be talking about detox symptoms. So for some of you that are not uh, really, if you haven't fasted a lot and you're, or never, maybe you've never fasted at all, we're going to be talking about detox symptoms. So things that you can expect, things that are typical, I'll say. Uh, we're going to be talking about refeed as well, because refeed is obviously very important. So after the fasting, what you should be eating. Uh, and then we're also going to provide you with information on essential oils. Uh, we it is Essential oils is something that you know the AHA team, we use on a daily basis. And uh, we have pretty much taken essential oils and uh, replace the medicine cabinet. Best mm. way to explain it. So um, all of those things are going to be provided with the uh, within the program. Um, but one, I want to come back to the, the preparation part of it uh, because that is the one part that that's where people fail, uh, and and people think that you know the, the reason that I say that starting directly after the holiday is so detrimental if you don't know what you're doing 
because you get all this motivation and then you're putting all the stuff into you that is obviously not good for you. Uh, and then of course, as soon as you start, it's going to dramatically hurt you. Um, as soon as you start your fasting period, you know, you're going to be 12, 14, 16 hours into it. Uh, and then your hormones are going to start going through some things based upon the, you know, you're not prepping and it's going to cause you to break your fast. So we're going to provide people in the program um, almost hour by hour, right? Uh, day by day, what you should be doing, what you should be eating, how to prep properly. And we're going to give, we're going to provide this information in a way that we've never done it before, uh, just in a large scale. Uh, it's things that I, uh, we talk about in the 40 day wellness program, um, but we've never done it in this way on to, to give it to so many people. So that's going to be super important. And, uh, and of course your mindset, how you think about things is going to be really important as well. So, yeah, that's a lot. <laughs> the, the goal here is to give you all a lot, right? With, with, with whatever we do, the goal is to over deliver and make sure that you all are getting value, um, which is, uh, you know, tools and information that's going to genuinely aid you in whatever it is you're looking to accomplish. Uh, some people said Steve talking in a godly tone right now. Wow. <laughs> um, there's people talking about how they, they don't lost 36 pounds. Um, they want to replace the medicine cabinet. So, uh, so the whole fam about to, to fast, I don't want to smell food. Um, listen, during this, during this process and part of the mentality coaching is understanding that, you know, we can't run away from food, right? Like we can't run away from food. We can't run away from friends and family. We need to learn how to be successful with our fasting and, 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 you know, dietary changes in spite of the distractions. So that's part of the mentality coaching, building a, um, a foundation that's strong enough to support you through the different distractions, right? The 4th of July, uh, you know, Memorial Day, um, birthdays and events. My thing is, it only takes a small period of time to really get your body and your mind straight. And if you think about, you know, depending on how old you are and how long you've been on your health journey or how long you've been struggling, it's like all we're really saying is give yourself the next couple of months, maybe, you know, one month, two months, three months to focus strictly on your health, right? Put your health as a priority over birthdays, over going out with the girls. I know hot girl summer's coming up. Maybe, <laughs> maybe you know, say you put pause on a hot girl summer just for this summer, right? And then you come back next summer with a vengeance because we've been living our best life all the way up until this point. And our best life has got us where we're at right now. So if your best life don't got you where, you know, you, you're in a, a place where you feel healthy, maybe fit or happy, then something needs to change. You know what I mean? So the goal with this is to walk you all through kind of kind of step by step right we're gonna we're gonna start with preparation and what i want you all to do because some some first of all some people were asking how do you sign up well let me answer that right for those who are just they want to sign up right now the uh link is, if you're on youtube the link is in the description box if you're on you uh, instagram the link is in the bio so you go to the bio and you click the link in the bio and it'll be a, a you know a link for you to join. Um, but but basically what we want you all to do with watching this live today is start mentally preparing for whatever goals that you have. Right. Get yourself a journal. Get yourself a vision board. You can start doing the mental work now. Maybe write out some affirmations. You know what I mean? Like m affirmations are extremely powerful. Now, like I mentioned earlier, I know everybody probably didn't hear this, but we're actually going to be uh, doing 30 days. This whole process is going to be 30 days. So what I want you all to do is put together some affirmations that you're going to say along this process. 30 days is a beautiful period of time to to daily affirm whatever it is you're looking to succeed, you know, uh, to get out of either this process or just in life in general. 30 days is a really good uh, period of time. Here's what happens when you start doing these affirmations. 
it's the idea you fake it until you make it right which means that it doesn't matter if um it doesn't matter if you believe what you're saying or not you say it in spite of right come up with something really positive to say and you say it in spite of your belief for 30 days and then after 30 days you've built a habit and now your mind starts to believe it and so the the power of this i, I like to connect it to the whole idea of the nocebo effect and the placebo effect so you all have probably heard of the placebo effect it's really really popular it's actually um really well documented although it's not necessarily well understood but um, the placebo effect is essentially where you have a disease, um, you are given a sugar pill, and you think it's the medicine that's going to like cure you of this disease, and your body, because you believe that you're going to be healed, your body does the healing. So that's the placebo effect, super popular. The nocebo effect is the opposite. It's the fact that you're perfectly healthy, but because you believe you have a disease, your body will manufacture that disease. Now, you say, Chris, what's the importance of this? Well, it's the same thing with the power of manifestation, affirmations, and things that you want to draw into your reality. So if you feel like you're at a place where you don't necessarily believe that you can achieve the things that you want in life, then your mind is going to manifest that disbelief. But if you start believing that you can achieve the things that you want out of life, even though they seem unrealistic, then your mind is going to start manufacturing that belief. So we need to come up with some really good po positive affirmations, right? Write them down, get them ready, and start saying them during this 30-day process. Now, uh, Steve, I'm going to pass you the mic here in a second, but I wanted to get to a, a super chat. Uh, Devontae Valentine, my main man, he said, Thank you, Kings. Can you briefly touch on inconsistency versus consistency and why you have found people tend to fall hard after a prolonged fast? Steve, you interested in, in tackling that? Hey, man, listen, I got all kinds of stuff. I've been, as, as some of you may or may not know, I'm fasting right now. And, uh, you know, I, I also own a detailing business. I've been working, been up since 730 outside working and uh i'm ready to rock so what, what you know whatever whatever you want i got it for you chris <laughs> okay did you did you get did you catch the question yeah yeah yeah. do you want me to go and answer it yeah man go ahead, <laughs> knock, knock it out don't don't give me these politically correct answers <laughs> all right my bad uh i was trying to stay in my godly tone right. um so <laughs> It's very interesting because we've been talking about consistency, which is uh, which is it's so interesting that we got that question. Um, consistency. <laughs> I have a I have a quote. I was going to say a famous quote, but it's not famous yet, uh, and it's my quote. But it is perfection is not needed, but consistency is a must. And the reason that I have found uh, the reason that I that I came up with that uh, was because I have seen in myself as well as other people that I have coached and people that you know have are the, in the AHA Facebook group uh, people come into the group and they're super excited they want to get started they hear that you can lose a ton of weight they hear you can heal um, they hear all of the things that fasting can do all the benefits and the the problem is that, that they come in and they don't really have the the right mindset behind it and they come in and they have all this zeal is what I'll call it, um, which is uh, energy or energy without knowledge. Uh, they come in with all this zeal and they get started and they will do a, they'll, they'll say, oh, I'm going to do 21 days. I'm going to do 30 days. I'm going to do 40 days like Jesus, right? I'm going to do all this fasting. I'm going to lose 100 pounds, da, 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 da. Uh, and then they, they start off and then they realize, oh, this is a lot harder than I expected. They end up failing. Uh, and then after they end up, you know, failing, then they're just like, well, I don't think I want to do that again. Or, and, and, you know, and then and then on top of that, uh, you have the, you know, the emotional trauma that then comes, which you experience failure, um, which is going to make you feel shame, right? You're going to be thinking about times maybe in your life where you have failed other times. Uh, it's going to really put you off from trying new things, which is a very unhelpful way of thinking. Um, so, I have found that being consistent, even if you're doing three days, five days, right? Something like that. 
and then you stop, stop it, and you, you know, take four days off, but then you do three days again, and you are consistently doing the right things, you are going to have good results. And uh, we have plenty of people that have shown uh, that consistency is, is important. And to be honest with you, it's more important than you coming in and doing a 40 day or a 30 day, something of that nature. Um, but the, but the thing that highlight the, the, the thing that this program highlights two things, um, if I can take another minute, uh, number one, it's going to be the preparation, right? The preparation is going is so important. I, I can't, I want to really get this across because I never prep. I always just went balls to the wall. And when I started understanding that preparation was key to a fat, to your fasting, it changed, it changed my whole, it changed everything, right? People were saying, I want that skinny neck action. Well, I got you, right? I, I we can teach you that. Um, and the second thing, which is, you know, one of the things that, that I really, you know, like talking about, of course, is our mindset. And uh, I had a question the other day and someone asked me, you know, about, uh, you know, when you are fasting, um, what do you what do you do when you're hungry? Right? And, and I was, you know, so I started answering the question uh, and then they were, you know, I, uh, it was basically, you have to find ways to cope. And they were like, well, I don't understand what is what is what is coping mean? And then, it, and then I realized that everyone doesn't understand what coping means or what that entails. And people think that it's just kind of a fancy word that psychologists come up with, um, you know, or you see people now using it on YouTube and Instagram. And, you know, it's just one of those cool words, right? But coping is a real thing. Uh, coping basically, well, the definition of coping is the cognitive and the behavioral effects uh, to manage, master, reduce, uh, or tolerate a troubled person's environment, right? Which is kind of a, you know, is it pretty simple? Um, pretty simple definition, but it's actually, it's really deep. Um, you can cope in a couple of different ways, right? You have external coping and then you have internal coping. So let's say, for example, you lose your job. How do you cope with that, right? You, you have to cope with that and it's an external stressor. Uh, and then you have internal stressors or you have, you have to cope in a different way for internal stressors. So internal would be like depression, right? You, anxiety, loss, guilt something of that nature, right? There's an emotion, shame, something comes up and you have to cope with it. And a lot of times I have, I'm starting to realize more than ever, especially in our group in particular, uh, is that we don't do a good job with coping. And um, that is one of the, some of the things that, we, that, we, that we're gonna be teaching in this program is gonna be teaching you how to cope with internal and external stressors. Um, you know, different things are going to come up. And a lot of times we find very unhealthy ways to cope, right? Denial, distancing ourselves from people. Uh, emotionally, we move away, uh, you know, or we have extreme outbursts, uh, self-rejecting, we become passive aggressive. And uh, one of the, you know, some of the, some of the really bad ones, uh, trivializing, trivial, tri trivializing, sorry, can't say that word. Uh, which is basically making something small really big, right? Blowing things out of proportion or magnification, self-harming. Uh, and then obviously one of the worst, which is, uh, you know, you can have psychological problems that turn into physical symptoms, right? It's a real thing, right? We, like emotions actually will cause physical damage. We can have emotional trauma and then that emotional trauma will physically manifest itself in a unhealthy way physically, so all of a sudden you'll develop a disease and you're like, I don't understand why. You go to the doctor and be like, oh, well, you have this disease. I don't know why I have it. Well, it's maybe it's not physical. It's very likely that it's emotional. Um, so that's, you know, some of those things, you know, we touch on them a little bit in the program, but um, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to talk about coping as well and uh, some other things to help you with your mindset to get you going. You know what I'm saying? Right. Because like coping, scope. Proper coping skills, understanding what it is, right? Understanding food addiction, understanding the the mentality of this whole process is very important in being consistent. I think I think when people hear that word consistency, they think, oh, it means to like continue moving forward without ever failing, without ever making mistake, or without ever, you know what I mean, having ha being set back. That's that's not what consistency means, right? That's perfection. And as Steve stated earlier, perfection is not required, but consistency is a must. 
So what we're is to not be perfect, but we want you all to when you fail, when you have a have an obstacle, when you you know get a, have a setback, to have the right mentality to continue forward in spite of that, right? And not beat yourself up because look, at the end of the day, we're not perfect. Like none of us are perfect. None of us are Superman, right? Steve included, the fasting guru himself. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? None of us are perfect. We all have our flaws. And, you know, as I've, I've mentioned many times throughout my journey, like this has been a, a gradient for me. You know, I started off, I, I kind of started off going hard, balls to the walls, if you will, you know, AHA after dark, keep up with me. But um, we, we then, then I, just, I decided, you know what, like, let me, let me kind of try to figure this thing out to where it's going to make sense in my daily life. So I wanted to shout out Devante, or I'm sorry, Deontay, Devante and Deontay, both messes. So uh, Deontay, uh, love you too, bro, man. We're good to, good to see you. Um, appreciate the super chat. And Reggie, uh, Reg edited. Yo, Reggie, I've been seeing you out there working. You know what I mean? I see them numbers. I see those views. I'm very proud of you. So happy to see that you're still doing well. And I'm um, glad you're enjoying the information. Steve, there's a lot of, it's a lot of chat going on right now. I know, I know. Uh, I know Steve, you know, they want that slim, that slim, Steve, slim, fast program. <laughs> uh, <laughs> they said, Steve, you a beast for doing all that fasting in a hundred degree weather detailing and all that stuff. Now, one of the things that I think I might throw a curveball, and, and uh -oh. here's the, here's the beauty of being in this, this group, right? Listen, we have a structure for what we're going to, to give you all, uh, you know, for being a part of this, um, this 30 day challenge with us, but you already know, like when the, when the, when the, the spirit, if you will, hits me, you know what I mean? I'm going to give y'all what we got. So, uh, we've got some really interesting things related to water. Um, we just got a, a, an amazing testimonial and I'm, I'm not going to necessarily like put all the details of the testimonial out there, but you all have probably seen that every once in a while I'll promote these uh, the vital jewel bottles that that I you know have on the website, and um, I remember a couple people were like, "Man, Chris, man, you just you just trying to sell us these bottles, like you just trying to make money off of us." And I'm like, first of all, that's never been me. Second of all, I only promote what I I use and what works. Third of all, like you're about to miss your blessing, right? Because if you think that it's just about money, you're you're out of your mind. So we just got a testimonial about one of the Vita Jewels that we, the Vita Jewel bottles that we sell, um, from a lady whose mother, uh, her blood was septic, right? So her blood was toxic. Um, she's an older lady, and you know the doctors wanted to put her on medication, and you you already know what it what it, how it goes down with the medical industry. So the lady was like, "Now nah, I'm about to take action." First of all, kudos to you for not you know, allowing them to just do whatever they want to your mother for stepping in. And because you have, because you know better, you took action and you did better. So she stepped in. She's like, I'm going to take my mom the Vita Jewel bottle. I've been enjoying this, this water for, you know, quite some time now. And um, I think that it's going to help my mom. After a week, well, first of all, the first time her mom had the water, her mom looked at the bottle. You know how when you eat something and it's real good and you just look at it? Her mom looks at the bottle. She said, what's in this water? <laughs> it, <laughs> it goes down so smooth, right? Because when you start getting older, the muscles in your throat start to weaken as well as the other the muscles in the body. Elderly, it's not that they don't necessarily want to drink. They have trouble drinking. And some of them even choke on the water. So you like we don't understand because we don't have that problem. But it's it's challenging for them to drink. And part of the reason they have trouble drinking the water is because the water molecules, as well as the, the contamination in the water, make the water rough to drink. It's one of the, the things that I hear a lot about the water, like, oh, this water is real smooth. Yeah, because it is smooth, right? So she was able to drink the water. Um, I think she said over the span of five days, she was drinking, you know, four, four uh, bottles. They're 16 ounces. So she's getting in a, a great deal of water. Um, and by the by the fifth day or whatever, they did they did some blood tests on her. Septic was gone. Mm. Doctor doctor said this had never happened before. Never he had never seen it happen before. Just from drinking the right type of water. And this is the top channel 
right? This is the type of information that we're going to be putting in this program. These are keys. These are tools. These are techniques. This is the difference between success and failure. It's understanding these things. A lot of people tell you, just drink a gallon of water a day, right? What has Chris always done? Take it a step further. Make sure that you distill your water. If nothing else, make sure you sun energize your water so that you can break down the water, water clusters so that it will be structured and energize your body so they can be used by the body. Because if you drink a gallon of water, you just pee it all out. So uh, I just that that testimonial blew me away. Um, I I believe the the lady's name was Yolanda. I don't know if it was Yolanda from our 40 day class. I don't know which Yolanda it was, but thank you so much for sharing that testimonial because it blessed me. And, um, I hope it's a blessing to somebody else. All right. Trying to see if there's any other questions here I want to address. Yo, Reggie's getting a lot of love, man. They, they, yeah. <laughs> they like Reggie, man. Yeah, man. Steve, you see any questions or anything you want to address before we sign out of here? Man, they want to know the price, man. I thought y'all already knew. Oh, okay. Y'all want to know the price? So, <laughs> so, so one of the reasons why we put this together is because the 40-day program is priced out of, of a lot of the, the communities, uh, you know, pr- their, I guess whatever they, they have to, to pay or whatever. So um, we made this very, very affordable, and the price is significant. So the price of the program or the, the it's not even a program, it's a challenge. To join the challenge, it's $61.23. Say, say, Chris, why is it $61.23? It's because of the number one, two, three, mm-hmm. right? So um, for the past, I would say, 15 years, the numbers one, two, three have been following me. For the past like 15 years, I remember noticing it in my early 20s. And even up to this very day, I see it everywhere. One, two, three. And, you know, if you're into numerology and stuff like that, there's different meanings of the number one, two, three. But uh, Stephen and I looked it up and we felt like it it resonated with the with the group and what we wanted to accomplish here. And the goal is to be very intentional and and purposeful with everything that we do so part of the price is also utilizing that that number the power of that number and what that number means and what it represents which is um something along the lines of what was it new beginnings fresh start uh keep going you know it it was it was a couple different things that we kind of looked up and we're like okay this 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 makes sense like you're on the right path keep going right and so um being a part of the community has has been great for a lot of people, but everybody everybody isn't a self starter. Some people need that group, so you're on the right path, and this is your this is your sign to keep going, keep keep pressing forward in that direction. That's going to get you those outcomes that you're looking for. Hey man, I love it. Um, the number the number one two three is uh, is great for new beginnings, new uh, new new challenges. And right now, and I'm sure I'm going to get corrected if I'm wrong, but I believe we're currently in a Jupiter retrograde, um, which is uh, a great time to start new things as well. Uh, it's a great time to press forward and, and do new things also. If I'm wrong, somebody can tell me I'm wrong, but it sounded really good when I said it, but I think I'm right. But, <laughs> but regardless, um, you know, people in, the, in YouTube talking, um, yes, it, it's priced very, um, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It, 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 it's basically priced to, uh, to help people get in. Um, at the same time, we want you to have skin in the game. There's, it's a challenge, right? We're going to be giving away prizes. Uh, so, you know, some of those, those uh, funds are going to be allocated towards that as well. Uh, and, you know, at the end of the day, I mean, there's no excuse, man. I mean, $61.23. I mean, let's be honest, that's, that's a, a night out. Now, I mean, you know, you go out to eat. And, you know, you go and one time, one time in a month and you pay for the program. Um, so it, it's definitely something that, you know, we're going to see if people are serious, you know. Um, I mean, as you can see, I'm not trying to toot my own horn, but, you know, I, I do work. And, um, you know, I, I, I try to teach what I have learned to other people. And uh, this was kind of, you know, kind of my baby, so to speak. Extremely active. 
lived uh, in this group, I will be asked with you. So if you have questions, if you're going to have concerns, right, you're going to have AJ coaches that are going to be there to help you. And you're going to be somewhere where you can really be like, yo, what's going on with you guys? How's everybody doing? And people will respond, right? When, when you have people moving in the same direction, right, looking for the same thing, then it's magical. Like it's, 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 it's absolutely magical when you can align people and their energy is all moving in the same direction. It's, uh, it's, you can, you can accomplish anything. So I, I know that we're going to have a lot of people that are going to have a lot of success because we've had the same success in the 40 day wellness program. We just finished out one of the classes last night and every single person, I believe it lost over 20 pounds, you know, just, and, and, and we only did two small fasts during that time, five days. Um, but they were doing other things. They were just prepping. Some people didn't even fast. They were prepping and they still were losing weight. Yeah. I, I think it was, I think it was closer to 15 pounds. Oh, 15. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. But you know, still, I mean, you know what I mean? Like it's easy money, right? We, we, right. we, one thing we know how to do is help y'all lose weight. That's easy. The beautiful, the beautiful thing about this and what we're looking to achieve with this is getting you to understand how to keep it off, Right. To avoid the yo-yoing and um, also, once again, build those fundamental those fundamental um, uh, things that are going to help keep you in the right direction, help keep you consistent. So uh, for those in YouTube, y'all been asking, how can you get the bottles? I just put a link to the shop. Um, if you're on Instagram, it's real easy. There's a link in the bio. It'll take you to our shop where y'all can get the bottles if you're interested. Somebody was asking, how do you sun charge the water? I do have a video on YouTube talking about how to sun char charge the water where I go into detail about the benefit of it. But um, it's very simple. I, I, I recommend that you start with distilled water. You get yourself a clear glass jar. It has to be glass. Do not use plastic. I don't care if it's BPA free. I don't care if it's food grade. Use glass, okay? Um, so you put your distilled water in a glass jar. You cork the top cheesecloth or something uh, to allow the water to be able to breathe. And you set it outside in the sun. If you have a gallon of water, you want to give it about eight hours out in the sun. And then you drink it. That's it. It's that, that simple. The sun does all the work for you. Now, one thing I wanted to address briefly um, as we go into this challenge. Remember, y'all, we are not Santa Claus. We're not the Tooth Fairy. We're not the Easter Bunny. We're not, you know, none of those fairy tale creatures, okay? We are human beings. Uh, we don't have the ability to make you do anything. We don't have the ability to grant wishes. Um, this is your responsibility, okay? Understand, we're here to provide the guidance, the platform, and the, the environment to aid you in your process. But I want to make sure that we're clear. We cannot do any of this work for you. And the reason I say that is because oftentimes people think that if they they you know join a program that by osmosis or just because they've joined it they're going to get the outcomes and you will not so here's your disclaimer if you join and you don't do the work you won't get the outcomes okay every program pretty much works the the difference is which one resonates with you right and if it resonates with you well enough then you'll join and you'll do the work so our goal is to provide a space where you all can feel comfortable, you know, get the much needed information that, you know, that you need to get to your goals. Um, our, go our goal is to provide a little clarity on some of the more elusive topics like, you know, how do you really manifest things and how do you how do you really actualize these things into your life? Um, but you got to apply it. And some of this stuff is going to be cheesy. Right. Steve teaches a lot of cheesy stuff. <laughs> but it's the che it's the cheesy stuff that works. I promise you, the cheesier the better, because life is a game of inches, right? We always want the big outcomes, and we associate big outcomes with big uh, steps, big strides. Like you got to go out and just do this real big thing, like a forty day fast, in order to get the big outcomes. No, you don't. You don't know. That's not how you do it. It's literally by laying one brick every day as perfectly as one brick can lay. That's the goal, right? It's the small incremental things that you're going to do every day. I heard somebody, somebody was writing in the chat. Um, when I talked about the affirmations, I'm setting the alarm on my phone right now. Make sure that I get my affirmations in.
beautiful. We have all these tools available to us and we don't use them. We, we live in the information age. We live in the age of technology, right? We've got Alexa and all these freaking computers telling us it is 45 degrees outside. Make sure you have your jacket. <laughs> Alexa, what's the recipe for chicken Alfredo? It is this, this, that, right? We've got all this information and it's, it's underutilized. We're lazy. And we feel like things are going to happen for us just because we want them to. And that's not the way the universe works. That's not the way nature works. That's not the way God works, right? Whatever your belief is, it's not the way it works. You don't, it's things don't just happen just because you want them to, okay? So um, that's pretty much all I got. Like, we're going we're gonna to get into this. Um, is there affirmation on the app? So, so the app is still in development. I'm not exactly sure the question if you're asking. No, she, she said, is there an affirmation app? Oh, is there so app? Not, not the AJ app, just in general. Oh, yeah, I'm sure there is. I'm sure there is. Listen, that's a good idea if you're really having trouble coming up with your own affirmation. But I would challenge you to, to come up with the affirmation that is personal to you. Because nobody knows what you need and what you want better than you, right? So there, you might find an affirmation that resonates with you. But the, the absolute best affirmation that you could ever come up with is the one that comes from inside. And one of the things that we're going to do is help you develop those those tools, right? It, you know, we're, we're going to this is a process. So you can start now, you know, I'll say this, right? One key to, to developing a really crispy affirmation, make sure that it, it's uncomfortable for you. That's a that's a real simple, you know, tip. If your affirmation doesn't make you feel uncomfortable, it's not it's not you're not digging deep enough. So, you know, whatever your affirmation is, if your goal is to, to be beach body ready by the end of the summer, right? So you can get that last little uh, September hot girl summer thing going on. You know what I'm saying? Got a couple weeks left. We about to get it going. And you feel like you're 60 pounds away from that goal. Then a good affirmation for you might be, I'm going to be ready for hot girl summer in September. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's that if that's your goal, if that's what you want to achieve, hey, say it because guess what? Now you got to be ready for what happens next. Because once you start saying these affirmations, now opportunities and to for you to 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 uh achieve these goals are going to start coming and you have to be ready to um implement that, right? You got to be ready to attack those opportunities because if you don't, then you miss your window. So once you start saying these affirmations, keep your eyes peeled because opportunities are going to come and those opportunities are going to help provide those outcomes. So that's, that's, you know, hey, that's good, man. You, you teaching spiritual now. I like it. You I didn't even realize it. Yeah. You, you teaching spiritual, man. Like a lot of times people don't realize, and I'm going to, I'm going to keep this short because I know we got to go, but a lot of times people don't realize when they start asking for things, the universe starts moving. Mm. right period it starts moving and then what happens is is that things in our life will happen and we don't realize is like the universe is moving things for us and sometimes there are going to be things that like we think are bad or negative but they really are things that need to happen in order for us in order for us to hit our goal right so you might say um you know uh, you know i want to make eighty thousand dollars next year and then three weeks later, you lose your job, right? And then how you react or respond to the loss of your job, or I'll even say this, if you've been here since the whole live, you know this word cope, how you cope with the loss of that job, right? That external stressor will determine if this is going to be a benefit to you and, and put you on the path towards your 80,000, or is this going to be a detriment to you? But the universe decided, well, I need to remove you from this place that you're at. You're only making 40,000. You're not going to get a promotion and make 80. I need to remove you in order for me to put you in a better place so that way you can make the 80. But if you decide to cope with it and you start eating, right? You start ordering pizza, you start, you quit your gym routine, you break up with your girlfriend or you start cussing out your wife at home, right? You start spanking the kids more often because you're just angry you don't know how to deal with your anger, right? 
then those things, then you're not going to get to the point where 80,000 is going to happen. So same thing with your weight. Everyone has been here. Everyone is sitting here right now. I guarantee has been vibing weight loss, right? I mean, let's just be honest. You're in the AHA community, right? So you're, you're probably vibing to a certain you know degree, weight loss, health, things of that nature, right? And I'm not saying that this is divine, right? That you divinely need to sign up for you know the, the challenge. But um, I mean, ask yourself, is this the universe moving something for you? And I'll just be completely honest. It just, I'll be very blunt. 63, 61, 23, I mean, you can't beat it. Um, I mean, once again, <laughs> so, um, I mean, we, we throw we throw money at just random stuff. I mean, I'll, I'll go buy, someone mentioned skating, I'll go buy a pair of wheels and my wheels alone will cost me $100, right? And I gotta buy bearings and then there's tax. I'm out the door easily $140 on a pair of wheels, right? I mean, you buy three pizzas, three large pizzas, it's, it's it's 4th of July. You probably, somebody out there bought alcohol, three pizzas today and spent $60, like for real. Like if you, if you are even in the thought process of, I want to go on a fasting journey, even just to get the information, even if you say, you know what, I'm just going to join just to get the information. Even if I don't feel like I'm ready to fast, you'll at least get the information. So that way, when you are ready, it's worth it. So uh i don't know no you you hit the nail on the head um listen somebody said what about hot boy summer listen i i haven't heard that song i don't know about hot boy summer uh i can't speak on that one can't speak on that one but you know dudes be wanting to get their abs popping so i'm sure that's definitely a goal i'm trying yeah. to get my abs popping but i mean it's going i'm looking at next year 2022 <laughs> right right you know what i'm saying well, you know, which is which is probably still a little bit of uncomfortable goal you know what i mean and that's and that's the that's the key, right? Stay in a state of un uncomfortability. You don't want to be comfortable. Comfortable, you don't grow when you're comfortable, all right. And you're and on the other side of your fear and your 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 comfortable condition is that's the outcomes on the other side of that stuff. So you're gonna have to get uncomfortable and you're gonna have to face your fears in order to get those outcomes. Um, I wanted to say real quick that in order to join the program. If you're on Instagram right now, you can click the link in the bio, okay? It'll take you to another page where you'll see the, the link for the 21-day uh, program. The, the, the name of the program is the AHA 21-Day Fasting Challenge, okay? Our, our goal is to renew, reset, and restore. If you're on YouTube, the link is currently in the bio or the description, sorry, um, and you'll and, and, and we'll, we'll we'll send out links as well as um, we'll send out links to those who are on our newsletter as well. So uh, and if you haven't joined the newsletter already and you don't want to miss stuff like this, make sure to join. You just go to a healthy .org, scroll to the bottom. You can join the newsletter. If you're watching on YouTube and you haven't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button um, like this video. Share it, y'all like this is if you have a friend a family member that you've been wanting to, you know, maybe get into either fasting or you want them to, you know, join you for your weight loss journey, or you just want them to just be in a positive environment, right? Where, where change can be sparked. Listen, energy spreads quickly. Y'all have seen it with the negativity. That's easy money, right? Negative negativity spreads like wildfire, but so does positivity. Don't, don't be fooled into thinking that only negativity spreads like wildfire this this group this very tight-knit group if you just want to be around positive people on facebook this is the group right so um the 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 starting time of the actual prep okay the official start date is july 12th all right we're going to prep for a week so you'll be able to join um, for from July 12th, I think it's the 12th to the 19th, 18th or 19th, something like that. You'll be able to join. Then we're going to cut it off, y'all. You're not going to be able to join once the prep phase is over. So if you want to join, make sure that you join before the by, by the 18th or whatever it is. All right. After that, we're going to go into the fast. That's going to last for 21 days. So if your goal is, you know, one week, uh, two weeks or three weeks, that's when the fasting is going to start. And we're also going to be teaching refeed. So don't worry. 
We're not going to leave you hanging. We're going to teach you how to break your fast and all of that stuff because I think a lot of people don't break their fast properly. That's where a lot of issues come from. And guess what? At the end, we're going to give out some prizes. We're going to, we're going to do our best to, to uh, salute the community for putting forth the effort. And um, I look forward to doing that. Like that's, gonna, that's what I'm waiting for, right? And if all goes well, we're going to do this again. We're going to keep this thing going. So for those who are interested in maybe doing this consistently, right, having that consistent accountability, here we go. Steve, any last words? Hey, man, I'm just, I don't know about y'all, but um, I'm doing this again, with or without you. Because uh, <laughs> I told I told Chris the other day, um, I'm, I'm, fin- I'm actually on a 21-day fast right now, so I'll be fasting with you, right, and then I'll be ending my fast during the program, and I'll be starting another one. And um, I'm with you guys. So if you just want to be like, yo, I want to just be rocking out with Steven. I want to have a direct connection to him and ask him questions or whatever. Like, let's do it. Like, I'm, I'm not playing any games. I, am, I, don't, I don't think that I've ever been this focused in my life. And not just with, you know, physical wellness, but uh, just business. Just the way, that my, the way that my mind is working. Um, just everything in general. So... Um, yeah. So once again, July 12th, join up. Um, somebody asked, is there a charge? 6123. Uh, once again, is the price point of the program? Uh, oh, I'm sorry, the challenge, uh, program challenge. It's, Whatever a, it's, you wanna... a ch- it's a challenge and we have attached challenge. the program to it, right? Yeah, it's, so... a, it's a challenge, but we, we attach the program to it so we can teach because I love teaching. So, yeah. um, and, and for those asking, is it a water only yeah, we're going to be teaching you how to do a water only, but you're more than welcome to do 21 days of juice because the most important part of this is the accountability and the environment. So whether maybe you maybe you wanted to do a juice fast, maybe, you know, a 21 day juice fast, but you who are you going to do it with? Right. That we're giving you an opportunity to join a community that's not going to fizzle out in three days. Right. After everybody decides, nah, we ain't doing this thing no more. You all are you're making a commitment energetically, financially and mentally, right? Your attention. And so that that um, that investment is going to keep people engaged throughout this process. That's the goal. So um, I look forward to it. We're going to talk about many different things. Don't worry, y'all. We're going to do some lives um, during the, 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 you know, the 20, the 30 day process as well. So you'll get an opportunity to interact, ask more questions. Don't worry about it. We're going to take care of you. Uh, so yeah, that's it. Thanks guys. We appreciate you. Um, peace. Peace. Good night. We'll see you in the Facebook group.